Good morning, everybody. I'm going to start my videos of yesterday with just a little narration. Um, we were so tired yesterday, we had a really hard time getting things done. So actually what we did was we went to, um, we started to have a business meeting, and you'll see a little bit of, of that. Tom thought that we should video that, although we were really not having a productive business meeting because we just couldn't think. Um, we had decided yesterday's job was to go out and get the, um, the supplies and start making uh, kind of an outdoor shower and a little outhouse space. And so Tom spent the morning uh, researching toilets and compost toilets. And um, what he found out were that the compost toilets that cost the most maybe are the best, like two grand. And then he found out that even those aren't good because the screens get clogged and you have to clean the screen. And you know, the whole thing about body waste and we're just very used to indoor plumbing. So then we thought, well, we'll go down to the basement and we'll just reinstate the indoor plumbing that was down there at one time. But then there was this huge mess of lines and water lines and they were all soldered, um, copper soldered lines and there was this this um, small, uh, what is it, water heater that's set up right over where the toilet was, so we'd have to move the water heater, and then the question was, does it work or doesn't it work? So he turned on the spigot, and all the water started coming out of there, but it wasn't hot, which means it doesn't work, plus it means um, that we still don't know how to get it out. And then we started researching, you know, everything that was going on in there, and we thought that's not gonna work, let's just start from scratch. So even, even researching wood was like too expensive to consider. So um, we just got tired and decided to go to Home Depot and do some checking out. And we walked around there and gave up. And then we um, went to BJ's to look at lights for the outside to light up the paths so no one breaks their neck at night. And we gave up on that because the um, solar lighting is so dim you can hardly see anything. So we went to Lowe's and we ended up with some marble chips. So that's what you're going to see in this video. Just Tom extending the path and laying down some chips and trying to de-weed it and the best way possible. And then I wanted to start working on my yoga room in the barn. Um, when I did that, I went over to the beautiful meditation area that I had made and found out that we um, were building mold cultures back there because it's been raining and raining and raining and raining and raining and there's a cement floor and it the moisture must have been condense condensing through there and so i had to actually scrub some mold off a couple of the bed frames that we had made and uh, move all that stuff out of there so now my meditation room has turned into an art room um i think it'll be better for that and we have to figure out how to get it open and and get it aerated. So those were some of the things that we messed with yesterday. Um, unfortunately, by the end of the day, we ended up tired and hungry, so we ended up getting a pizza, which completely doesn't work with my whole healthy lifestyle, and I shouldn't be eating gluten or dairy. So we kind of messed that up too, um, but we did get some stuff done, and i um, glad to show you. So um, watch please. Or don't. It's your choice. Um, great. Thanks. So my thinking is, when you're looking at pictures, what are you trying to figure out with the pictures? Because the pictures have plans and the plans tell you how to do things. And so, oh, okay. um, and there's all different kinds. Like there's, there's bathrooms where, I mean, we want to have is Part of me, yeah, there we go. Part of me is like, um, easier to put it in the frickin' building. Because <laughs> you already have a building, but not the outdoor shower. It's easier to put a toilet in the building, but then you have the whole compost thing in a building. Mm -hmm. 
And if it has odor, then the odor's in the building, and the whole building stinks. No, I know. I know, so you so can't do that. that. No. Here's the easy, easy DIY showers. Yeah. Because we're sitting here, it's your time to go out. She left a half a carrot and a bunch of grass on the rug. Oh, did you bring that grass in? Yeah. Carl was looking at her like she had something in her mouth. That's what it was. <clears throat> <the> grass. <clears throat> okay. 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 This is what happens. All right, but you can't have the toads together because no one's going to poop together. Oh, I see. You're going to have the, the stalls here and then they... No. Why can't people... <laughs> <laughs> The old time? I never understood those old time dolls. I know, but that's what they, they had. had. Yeah, you but. You could sit there and chop. We're <laughs> not that kind of society. We are a <laughs> modest society. We can't have that kind of outlaws. Oh, you're doing your business. You can read the newspaper. <laughs> we don't read newspapers anymore. We read our phones. <laughs> All right, so then we need two stalls. Okay. So. Here's our shower stall, here's our pooper stall, and here's our pooper stall, right? Uh huh. We do a bench, right? Just a wooden bench, box type thing. Yep. Bucket. Right? Yep. Lid. Yep. And then on the back here, door. Yep, flap. Yeah. Take that out. Dump it. Yep. Yeah. So, you know, so then basically you're looking at a post there, a post there. Maybe you do a post for each one of these. I don't know that you need that many posts. So we're working on the garden path. It was really skinny. It had been overgrown through many years and we were feeling like people would break their neck on it. So we've decided to widen it. Seems to have been that wide before. We have these amazing gardens around the house. Lots of flocks and black-eyed Susans. Right now they've really been blooming and we have a lot of weeds in there and we're afraid the weeds are taking over so that's another one of our projects. There's a lot of thyme. Thyme is really great. The um, bees love it and there's more flowers. So, right. so Tom, what are you doing? Poisoning myself. Spreading preen to kill the weeds. Spreading preen to kill the weeds on the path we're making, and then we're going to put black paper down, and then we're going to put marble down. So, we chose marble because it's white, and it would help reflect the light when we put the lights out so that people can walk around after dark and not get hurt. So, that's what we're doing right now. Hopefully the weeds don't come through.
Okay, we're here in the yoga barn. I'm trying to decide what to do. I'm gonna get some mattresses to put on those bed frames that we made that are covered with those blankets. And that'll provide comfortable seating and will also double as the guest beds when people come and hang. And um, we're gonna put screens on those windows and uh, those windows used to slide open so we're gonna make that possible again. And we put twinkle lights in here But I'm kind of at a standstill. If I want to bring more of those bed things into here, and as we're gonna take you around this way, I've got a bench there. I put my cushions and stuff on it, but I feel like that just looks messy. So I'm not fond of that. And then up on the stage, I've got a bunch of tables to do art, but there's really no good lighting up there and it's kind of hot. So I'm thinking that those need to come down. Um, I have some really cool African masks on the wall, although I'm wondering if they'll show up way better on a white background than the barn would. So I've got some decisions to make. And I'm not really sure how I'm going to make them. I think I might start with taking a couple more beds from the other room and putting them there instead of the bench and putting the bench in the other room. That's what I think I'm going to start with. Although they looked really great in the other room too. Um, we still have to critter proof that room so 